<laughs> Hi, this is Sarah. Welcome. How are you? Today, I thought we would do something a little bit different and answer some questions regarding Reiki and energy. I have been a traditional Reiki master sensei or teacher for 10 plus years now, and I own the Serenity Reiki Clinic. I'm blessed and very grateful to be able to travel all over the world, treat many clients, and teach classes too. I've been asked some really interesting questions along the way, and I thought maybe these are questions that you would have too. So one common question I get asked quite a bit is about grounding. And you may hear people talking about the term being grounded or feeling ungrounded. So what exactly does that mean and how do you ground? And that's a really good topic, isn't it? Because grounding, feeling safe and being present in the here and now allow you to have an authentic human experience. So it's really important. Also, if you're doing any type of energy work, it's critical that you stay grounded and focused on what you're doing and stay present in the moment. So it's really a great question. Grounding begins by, as I said before, being present and being present in the moment. Unfortunately, many of us are distracted and our attention is elsewhere, not focused on the present moment or the present experiences we're having. We're daydreaming, we're thinking about an event in the future or the past, or we're worrying and stressing. So it's not as easy as just, oh, well, I'm awake, so therefore I'm grounded. <laughs> no, not quite. Okay, so here's a simple technique you can do anywhere, anytime that should help you get focused and get grounded quickly. Okay, so begin by being present in the moment. Take a moment to get centered and clear your mind of other thoughts, worries, feelings, emotions, and just become present in this moment. As stray thoughts or sensations pop into your mind, gently push them away and stay centered and aware of your attention and where your focus is going. After you've taken a moment to get centered and clear your mind, shift your focus to your breath. How are you breathing? It's time to relax and take some easy, gentle breaths. And just breathe deeply and evenly. Don't push it and don't strain. Breathe in and breathe out slowly. This should be easy and you should immediately feel better. Next, a good way to get centered is to become one with the earth. To imagine that you have roots coming out the bottom of your feet. Yes, I said imagine that you have roots coming out the bottom of your feet. <laughs> Imagine that you're rooting this moment to the planet. You're not flitting off. You're not drifting away. You're rooted to this present moment. As you imagine these roots coming out the bottom of your feet, see them in your mind's eye with your eyes closed. See them coming out the center of your feet and going deep into the earth. These roots are going down deep and they're connecting you with the earth, keeping you centered and grounded for the day ahead. The earth is always ready to accept us and glad when we root this way. So allow yourself to accept the earth, breathe naturally as you set the intention that you are grounded, present, and ready to begin your day or whatever event you have going on, okay? It's always wise to set your intention of what you want to happen to after you ground. For instance, I'm grounded and safe and I'm going to have a great day. I'm going to be in loving gratitude today. I am present and ready to make the most of today's opportunities, something along those lines. The more you practice this technique, the easier it gets and you can ground almost instantly. In the beginning, you may find yourself drifting off a couple of times during the day. Just redo it. See yourself grounding again the same way as many times as you need to. Clear your mind, watch your breathing, see the roots going down. Repeating this technique should help you become calmer, more centered, and give you more focus as well. And like I say, it will get easier the more you practice. Okay, next question. Oh, this is a good one. <laughs> Sometimes after a Reiki session, I feel kind of drunk or high. Is this normal? I get asked this quite a bit from students and from clients. <laughs> yeah. It happens. Um, it happens occasionally, and sometimes it happens quite often. The amount of energy being pulled into the body during a session may be immense, and you may feel lightheaded, drunk, or even dizzy for a while afterwards. Mm. Also, you may have trouble seeing with your eyeglasses or contact lenses for a while after a session. This too is common. Most people report feeling very happy and carefree after an intense Reiki session. Because <laughs> you know the side effect of Reiki, right? You know, right, that there is a side effect of Reiki. Yeah, the side effect of Reiki is, of course, happiness. <laughs> 
Normally what happens is um, I have the client sit down after the session, give them a bottle of water, and we talk for a little bit. And I kind of gauge how they're feeling, how they're doing. And when I know that they're grounded, I <laughs> get them to do the exercise. And when I know they're grounded and they're okay to drive, I let them go. Until then, I just kind of let them sit and talk to me about the session and about how they're feeling. So yeah, it's normal. It happens. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm about out of time, but if you have a question you'd like me to answer about Reiki or about anything we do at the Serenity Reiki Clinic, please feel free to email me or leave it in the comment section below. I love hearing from you guys. Okay, if you haven't subscribed already, please do, and feel free to like this video if you found it helpful. I have a couple of events coming up, and I'll be traveling soon. I'll be teaching and, of course, doing Skype sessions online, too, if you want to get together. If you want more information, go visit SerenityReikiClinic.com and stay up to date by joining our newsletter. If you haven't been in a while, check out the event page at Serenity, and I look forward to seeing everyone soon. Bye-bye. Reiki blessings. Mm -hmm.